What's up you guys? Thank you so much for stopping by Galadon Gaming today. Create, enter, and win tournaments. Well, the win part I'll let you figure out on your own, but to create and enter them, we go over to the tournament tab and right away we can see here that as you create tournaments, the smallest one is 500 gems and has 50 people. You can set a password to any tournament so that only people with that password can get in. The length of the tournament is variable all the way up to three days long is the longest tournament and then the preparation can either be set to 15 minutes or two hours. Now there are nine sizes of tournaments, the smallest being 50 players that cost 500 gems, but here's a quick secret. The achievement for creating your first tournament, 500 gems. So you get it right back. Now we're gonna look at the other sizes. Obviously it starts out at 50 and works its way up to massive sizes here. You can see it's going to cost you 10,000 gems, but you can start a tournament for 300 people and the winner gets 600 cards, 20,000 gems, 500 people, and we're getting up there now to the tournaments that you should expect to see me hosting on Mob Crush, and that is going to be the 50,000, the 100,800 player tournaments, and the biggest of all, 250,000 gems, a quarter of a million gems, about $1,800 US, gets you a tournament for 1,000 players where the winner gets 15,000 cards and roughly half or exactly half of the entrants are going to get a prize of their own. Now, like I said, I'll be hosting tournaments all the time, but I would imagine most, if not all of my tournaments will be password protected. So you will need to stop by the Mob Crush stream to get that password and also for the additional prizes that I'm going to be giving out above and beyond the regular tournament prizes, you've got to be present to claim those. So let's go ahead and create a tournament right here. Let's call it OMG It's Big because it's the biggest tournament. It is the uh, 250,000 gen tournament. So it's true. Get your minds out of the gutter. All right. So we can choose again the password. We can choose the length, the preparation time. And there it goes. Last confirmation and a quarter million gems gone. Now, again, this is in the developer version. Of course, you guys, this isn't a real tournament, but just showing you how it looks, how it works. And now other people will join the tournament or at least hopefully they will. Now, if you set it up so that there's not a password, then anybody that has that tournament hashtag that you see at the top of the screen is going to be able to join. Also, I tested it out. If for some reason you mess it up and nobody joins your tournament, you will get refunded your gems at the end of the tournament. So here we're on the page where it shows tournaments near you. So obviously not every single tournament will show up here, but you can see here, we can take a look at the pretend developer version, Reddit mega tournament. We can click on the information tab, find out a little bit more about the tournaments themselves, about the card caps. And again, right there, the green button, you can join this tournament. It doesn't need a password. It is an open tournament. But again, in addition to the tournaments near you, there is going to be a search bar at the top of your screen, and you can use that to search for other tournaments that maybe you found out about from a friend or from a streamer like yours truly. You can enter the information there, search it, find it, and join it if it is open or if you have the password. So right here, I joined this tournament. I don't understand the name, but you can see immediately there's a battle button, and I am going to go in and try to find somebody to battle now. Because there was only one other participant, obviously I'm not going to find him, but it just kind of shows you what it looks like when you're searching for a battle within a tournament. Now you can only belong to one tournament at a time, but there is a leave button. I'm going to go ahead and leave this tournament. Now, of course, I won't get to win a prize from the tournament, even if I were to finish in the money, so to speak. But now I'm eligible to join a bigger, better tournament that I saw pop up, or maybe somebody told me about. Now I am in a 1,000 player tournament and it is also possible that these large tournaments don't fill up all the way. If a 1,000 person tournament only has 500 participants in it, then all 500 players will end up with a reward when the tournament concludes. So this is a 1,000 player tournament and let's just go ahead and pretend, I know it's a far-fetched fantasy, but I won the tournament, yes, it wrapped up and there it is, I am awarded the first place tournament chest that will take two weeks to open if I don't use gems. Now it does take a lot of gems to open it, 
but those two weeks are going to prevent me from entering another tournament unless I open that chest first. But again, this is the best chest in the biggest tournament. All of the rest of them will take a shorter amount of time. All right, so let's go ahead and click on the chest and you can see that is a massive reward. 15,000 cards between 75,000 and 105,000 gold, 500 epic cards and over 3,000 rare cards in there. And of course, I would imagine you are almost guaranteed to find legendary cards as well. We'll take a look at the achievement. There it is, 500 gems for hosting your first tournament, so it's basically free. And speaking of hosting tournaments, let's get into this big news. Yes, you know that Clash Royale tournaments are coming, but now I am coming to Mob Crush and bringing with me huge tournaments. They are going to be sponsored in part by Mob Crush Thousands of dollars worth of prizes coming to you, and I will have the biggest tournaments in Clash Royale available on Mob Crush. So I hope you guys can come check it out. It's going to be an amazing time, some exciting battles, some crazy prizes. I have all sorts of stuff to give away. I have got golems. Check it out. Look at the size of this guy. That is a big golem right there. And look at this. Have you ever seen this before? Right there. That is a full-size king's tower right there. That thing is monstrous and heavy and, well, it, it, yeah, okay, so it's a good thing and it's awesome and it's big and there are going to be some of the prizes in addition to the tournament chests that will come from these big, big tournaments and, of course, gift cards. I've got all sorts of gift, gift, give it a gift, gift, gift cards to give away on a Mob Crush while we are live streaming to random people and, of course, two tournament participants as well. So get ready, you guys. The tournaments are just around the corner, and when they start, I will be streaming the biggest of them on Mob Crush. I hope you guys can come join me. The link is right down here in the description. Please do check it out, and I will be there interacting with you guys. It is one of my favorite things to do. It is that two-way conversation. You guys can ask me questions, and we can interact and watch these battles as they happen. So check out Mob Crush. Get ready for big tournaments. I'm going to get you guys in them. No more crying that I didn't get in a tournament. No, you're going to get in. It's going to happen. Just make sure that you are following me, subscribed. Check me out on Mob Crush, and I'll see you guys there for full attacks. Full attacks. Well, I hope you guys are half as excited as I am. You thought I gave away a lot of gift cards before. You haven't seen anything yet. It's going to get crazy up in here on Mob Crush. More gift cards than ever. All these big real-life Clash Royale prizes as well. Join me for the biggest tournaments ever, and I'll see you there. Well, I was going to say full attacks, but I already said that, so I'll just see you. Yes! See you there. Oh, I'm so smooth. I can't stand it. Smooth as sandpaper, Galidon. Not the 500 grit either. More like 50 grit. 40 grit. Perhaps 17 grit. Peter, I get the point.